Hey guys, welcome back to the McClure's in Motion, or welcome if you're new to my channel. I'm coming to you today with my favorite video to film, and that's what I've got my kids for Easter. I tend to be extra and go overboard with things, but I try to use Easter as a time to prepare them for the upcoming summer months because we do spend a lot of time in the camper. So just keep that in mind as you watch this what I got my kids for Easter. I have two children, both girls, one 16 and one seven. So I have a wide range of age and I do have four nieces and three and two nephews. So come back to watch those videos because I'm gonna put together a little basket for them too, as well as for my husband and my brother. So let's get started with what I got my kids for Easter. So like I said, I try to use this time to prepare them for the upcoming summer season. So we have a tumbler in this orange color for my oldest because she does attend public school and this just happens to be her school color. She does have rather long hair, so she's been trying to um, master the heatless curls so I bought her this Heatless Curls Bendy Hair Rollers for Easter. We are a traveling family, like I said. So this is a mini marker on the go art kit. It just gives her some little things to color with some markers. An avocado handheld fan. I thought that would be neat to have for when she's out on a bike ride this summer. Like most teenagers, she does have a set of AirPods. This is a new AirPods case for her. This is from Plum Pretty Sugar. I got this at TJ Maxx for $6.99. It's her favorite color, it's yellow. I got this little tin can of bubbles. It's supposed to be reusable. It says blowing bubbles, bubble tree. Made in the USA, non-toxic, refillable aluminum bottle. Like I said, we spend a lot of time outside in the summer. So we spend a lot of time in campgrounds. So I got them each a set of chalk eggs for Easter. Like all kids, they're into these squishy things. So this is a frog. I think I got this at Walmart. It was like or three dollars these poppets they're like um those little noise makers that you use at fourth of july they come in the shape of an easter egg so there's those i got them the exploding bunny poop to go with that my kids are very into fidgets so they like these little teeny tiny uh, poppets. So that's what this is. It's a poppet pets. This is a spring limited edition. Again with the squishy toys. This is a neato mellow marble egg. My kids love the, the anything squishy, neato, slime, play-doh, anything like that. This is just another thing they can take and fidget with when we're camping. They can throw it at each other and it won't hurt. It's got a ball with flashing lights in it so they can play outside in the dark with it at night. My oldest does have extremely long hair. And so I bought her this set of teleties that are in her school colors. I bought this little bag from the Dollar General that can clip onto her backpack. She likes anything succulent and plants, so that's that. <clears throat> She's into stitch very much, and I found this stitch palette at uh, TJ Maxx. It's got some pretty colors in it. Got that for her. Like I said, she's got some hair, 
So I bought her this really pretty wet brush. These are fantastic for kids that have a lot of hair. This is kinetic sand and this little egg. Like I said, very sensory seeking kids in my household. This is um, marshmallow scented Peeps Putty. Comes with some little Easter egg cutters and a little box to keep it all in. What's an Easter basket without bubbles? So she will, even though she's 16, get bubbles because she'll go outside and play with her sister. That's a dish in addition to the refillable bubbles. I got these little squishmallows. This little bird's name is Tristan. They love these things. I don't really know why, but they're everywhere in my house. We have tons. To go along with that, I also got this squishmallow whose name is Fritz that will click onto their backpack. So they're getting those. I just thought this was cool. This is a confetti crayon. I found this in the Target dollar spot. And it um, looks to be made up of several different things. But again, it was one of those things I thought they could spread out a paper tablecloth and color on it during camping season. I just bought this because of the nostalgia of it. It's, it's a sidewalk chalk peep. Peeps are iconic with Easter. And I just thought they had to have that. They each got a scratching scratch activities pad this one just happens to be the sweet treats version for her it's got food fun tic-tac-toe dots and boxes mazes all kinds of stuff in there this was like a couple bucks at walmart and then i found this really cool dipping dots pen it's scented it's got 10 little things on it and they're different flavors strawberry orange grape watermelon chocolate lime raspberry blueberry and banana just thought that was cool again another fidget this is called a fiddly wiggly from target to dollar spot all of these things are stuff that they can use and if they use them and abuse them this summer it's okay if they go in the trash after they've gotten their wear and tear from them what Easter basket is complete without a chocolate bunny? My oldest one likes Rice Krispies, so she got the Rice Krispie, Krispie, Rice Krispie flavored one. Um, both of my kids really like Cheez-Its, so I thought these little cute Easter Cheez-Its would be a good addition to their basket. I'm not sure what the hype is over these, but my little one absolutely loves gummies. And this is a gummy lunchable. It's a pepperoni pizza kit, but it's a gummy. This, my oldest one is very much into sunflowers. I got this at our local pop shelf. I just thought that was cute. She can use that while she's journaling this summer when we're camping, because she likes to keep a journal. And then this is another one of those Neato things. This is called the Chickadee Doos Neato. So it's shaped like a little chick and it's from the Neato brand. It says, gift me, love me, squish me. And so this one's yellow and pink. Again, her favorite color is yellow. Then I got her, her first pair of actual Birkenstocks. These are the rubbery edition. She wanted those to be able to slide on her feet when she's coming out of track practice and that kind of thing. And then to go along with all of this stuff, I got her a few like treat things. We have a Cadbury cream egg, um, Nerds clusters, um, this little bunny full of Hershey Kisses, uh, Reese's Pieces eggs, and some Hubba Bubba Bubble Gum. And last but not least, Pringles. And then a tradition that my grandmother started when I was little is that we always got some kind of bunny for Easter. This is a Peeps bunny in the color yellow. 
and it is marshmallow scented. So, and then the last thing I got her is this dried flower centerpiece Lego set. Um, she really enjoyed the one I got her for Christmas. It was a floral bouquet, and so she will get some good use out of this. And now on to my seven-year-old, who will get very similar things. She, too, will get the um, Peeps Plush Bunny. <clears throat> she, too, will get the Nerds clusters. Um, you move all this stuff around so I can get to her basket. Show you what she got. Okay. Again, what's Easter without bubbles? So she got her own little bubbles. This one just happens to be a flower and it happens to be pink, which is her favorite color. She is my chocolatey, on top of chocolatey kid. So she got the Cocoa Pebbles uh, rabbit. There's her Neato Chickadee. It's pink and blue. Her favorite colors. She got the Charms Blow Pop pin. It has 10 cents as well, but hers is just Blow Pop scent flavored, scented. These are her little set of sunglasses. She's all the time stealing mine out of my car. So I thought those were just suitable for her. They come in this little carry-in case for her this summer. Here are her Birkenstock dupes from Target. I won't put out the money for Birkenstock for her yet because she ruins everything she um gets so these are just the cat and jack brand from target her cup is pink because she is my pink girl loves pink um this is her spring limited edition poppet pets her hairbrush is tie-dyed and shaped just a little bit differently. Her hair is not as long as my oldest one's. So this is more suited for her. Here is her scratch activity. It's just Easter themed. Here's her Fritz and her Tristan. Because if I buy for one, I have to buy for the other. Her Gummy Lunchable. Her a uh, little travel kit is a little bit different. She's into this scratch art stuff. So I found this at Walmart. I think it was a couple dollars. She'll enjoy that. This is her marble mellow egg. It's just purple and pink. Her favorite colors. Again, my kids are into the squishies. There's her bunny poop. Her peeps bunny with pearl dough in it. This one is her little refillable bubbles. Um, this is her llama bag that has a little clip on it. I thought she could put this on her backpack and carry it to school with like her ice cream money in it. I have just stuck inside of this. Her little, she like her sister loves stitch, but it's smaller so I got her these little stitch figures there's that one there's Miss Angel and there's stitch with a present uh, here is her purple bunny sidewalk chalk her Pringles her confetti crayon is a little bit different than her sisters it's a uh, pink and blue and purple and red and like I said, they'll use this when we're camping. We'll lay out paper on the table and they can use it to draw with it. To save having a thousand different crayons out. There's her poppet ball that lights up so she can play with her sister at night. Here's her P 
pen for her to use when she's journaling this summer. It's um, fuzzy. So I thought that she would like that. There's her Poppet's egg. Purple, of course. Favorite color is purple. She got some jumbo colored pencils. Her sister got these as well. I just forgot to put them in her basket. I'll have to find those. Then there's her Cheez-Its. She also got a set of Pelly Ties. But hers are the teeny tiny ones because she doesn't have a lot of hair. And then here's her kinetic sand. And we are in the LOL phase of life with her. So we have bought into the Crayola craze that is the LOL surprises. So she got this one. And this is the big one. She has one of these. It's pink already. Really loves this. Plays with it a lot. And then these are something she's seen on YouTube somewhere. These are the baby born surprises. They're tiny little babies about that big. And they come in here. You either get twins or triplets. And these are food themed. So she could get like she has a set of macaroni and cheese ones. She can get taco ones. Ramen ones. I can't remember what else was in this set. But she was intrigued by these because they're tiny. She's into the tiny phase of life. We're also into the Squishmallow phase of life. Like I said, this is her Squishmallow surprise. Her sister got one as well. It's green right here. Um... And that's it in this bag. I also got her this little bug catching kit. I assume this came from the Target dollar spot. It wasn't in the dollar spot when we found it though. Somebody had just kind of put it on a shelf. And we were very intrigued by this because it's shaped like a camper and we love to camp. So that just seemed fitting for my youngest. I also found in the Target dollar spot these body wash pens in different colors. There's a teal one, a purple one. I think I got a blue one and a pink one too. I'm going to split those up. Give two to my oldest, two to my youngest. They'll use those in the camper bathtub because we don't have a bathtub in our house. We have a shower. Also this little flashing axolotl light. They'll use that this summer when they're riding their bicycles. They can turn it on and while they're riding their bicycles, people will be able to see them. I got my youngest this little peeps cup. She is terrible at keeping up with things. So I try to make sure that anything she has that she's going to use in the camper is disposable. And if it's lost, it's not very expensive. So I get these cute little cups from like the dollar section at Target or Walmart. I think this one was a couple bucks. She has hit a growth spurt and none of her summer clothes fit anymore and so i bought her just a few things to go along with summer so there's a cute little llama shirt and a cute little pair of shorts these are cat and jack brand i got these on a good sale when target was having like a 20 percent off kids clothes i got her this pair of it's like jersey knit material shorts and this long sleeve sweatshirt to go with it because we live in Appalachia and um, sometimes our days are really warm but our nights are kind of chilly so I got her those we're into anything that's tie-dyed bright anything that has a baby right now she's very interested in we do live on a farm so she's seeing the baby calves and the horses and the baby chicks and the baby pigs all those things are being born right now so she's very into nature and life and how it takes process so this is a puppy surprise it is supposed to be uh, pregnant it can have three babies four babies and five babies I'm not sure how many there this one has but I know she's gonna love it because it's tie-dyed and last but not least, because she is 
this much like her sister. She likes her little makeup things. And she is my Pop-Tart fiend. She loves a, a good Pop-Tart. And so I seen these at TJ Maxx. And they're just little Pop-Tart flavored lip balms. So I thought she would like those. There's a, a vanilla milkshake, a hot fudge sundae, wild berry, brown sugar, strawberry. So she'll get a kick out of those. Guys, I thank you for being with me today for this What I Got My Kids For Easter video. If you wouldn't mind to like, comment, and subscribe, I'll be back with other videos for my nieces and nephews, What I Got My Husband For Easter, as well as the summer gets rolling we'll get into some camping content and let's pack the camper and all that stuff so i hope to see you back in my next video again like comment and subscribe and we'll see you in our next one